Hey fam, it's Mama Bear and I am back with another Savings Challenge stuffing. I have a couple more new freebies. I have my kind of budget. This is a March, I'm doing this for March. It's a one, five and $10 for a total of $80. I also have this scratcher from, oh no, I forgot who this is from. Darn it. But I bought these last month and this is just uh, from the set. And this one is also March. I just marked everything for $1 for a total of $18. And I also didn't mark this. Sorry, I will have them linked in the description. I forgot to mark them, my apologies. So I do wanna start off with the $80. So I have one, two, three, four, four twenties make $80. Go ahead and color these. But um, how's the month going for you guys? We're still in the, let's say, not even a halfway point. Oh, no, this is dried out. Not even a halfway point yet. And I think it's still going, it's trucking along pretty well so far. I know a lot of kids are out for spring break, so it's been pretty nice and quiet on the streets lately. Um, we've been able to enjoy our parks more, almost like... Uh, free raining the parks because everybody's gone. The library's been pretty deserted as well. Uh, we homeschool our little, so we don't really do spring break. We kind of break as we need to, as frequently as we need to, with no restrictions on the school calendar, which is convenient. It works very well for our family, unschooling and homeschooling curriculum is nice. I'm sorry, the coloring is pretty terrible because I'm using the chunky crayon. The marker ended up drying out. I have the retractable Crayola markers and I just bought them from Target not even two weeks ago. So I'm not sure why it dried out so soon. Unless I just got a faulty pack. But so green is out there and I'm just coloring all these bills. So I have the 480. I'm just going to stuff the 80 and move on to the next. But I'm really loving the um, freebies. As uh, one of the YouTubers that I follow um, on budget stuff, save, repeat, I believe her name is Melissa. She made a good point about you're trying to save money and doing these challenges and then you buy the challenges is kind of like defeating the purpose in a sense, which I was like, oh, duh, that is so true. So I found a lot of YouTubers that create free resources and I have a pro Canva subscription and I started tinkering around with making my own in January. So it's been pretty fun. I've been getting a lot of ideas from others, but I've also been taking advantage of the free ones. Again, this is a total of $18. There are 18 total letters and icons combined. So that's 10, 15, 16, 17, 18. I'm just going to color this with a variety of colors. Look at this. The Dollar Tree markers don't fail. There we go. Crayola slipping. It's so interesting, this year, Easter is in March as well. So, um, if you guys celebrate Easter, what are you planning to do? Besides like church and things, do you do it like a good big Sunday meal? Or is it more like chill and low key? Do you do Easter egg hunts kid with kids or do something out in the community. Every year we kind of play it by ear. We don't really have a set tradition. So um, we'll see what this year brings. Man, the Dollar Tree job markers on point. Well, I spoke too soon because this one is as dry as that green Crayola. Let's try this one. So yellow is out. Okay, this little one works. Let's record this. 
that one. It's kind of hard to make out anyway, so. And the challenge, the savings challenges are really just a fun way to track money. So it's no shade against people who do want to buy, buy challenges because I'm, I still do buy them. So I'm not acting like I'm above anyone else. But it is a good uh, point to say, hey, if you're actually about this journey of saving money, save as much as you can and take advantage of the free ones. I know the ones that I made, I put them on my website, RileyApproach.com, and they're like a dollar. So it's practically free. It's cheaper than the dollar store now, which I don't know if y'all saw, they're increasing the price again to a dollar seventy-five. Not sure when it's rolling out, but I did see that. And I was like, wow, nothing safe from uh, inflation apparently. But yeah, the Dollar Tree is bumping up prices up once again. And I know in our Dollar Trees here, they have um, the $5, I think it's called the $5 spot or $5 deal. What I'm, I forgot the name of it, but there's like a section that everything's like $5. And then everything else on the other aisles are the, the raised on 125. It's like, okay, it's only a matter of time, I guess, before they raise the price again. This did not turn out as cute as I wanted it to because all of my markers are all messed up. One moment, Shug. That was my little in the background. It's telling me that he found a song. I'm going to be wrapping this up very quickly. The coloring isn't doing it for me anyway, so <laughs> that's even more of motivation to quit while I'm ahead. But I do thank y'all for y'all time and your attention today. I will see you on the next one. Fair hugs.